I'm Landis, I'm an idiot, and welcome back to Void Train. So, it turns out, <laughs> the issue I had with the save thing was essentially I pressed the, <laughs> the wrong button. It's, yeah, genius. I did happen to find a shotgun part and then fire some bullets and pick up the gun that was thingy and yeah, now we got this thing. Which we'll have a, a closer look at in a minute. We increase the carriage on the construction one. And we put this funny little wooden thing over our last carriage. I, I'm not sure if I plan on keeping it, but it, it's a nice little thing for our garden. Yeah, nice. And in here, we just spread it out a bit more. Made, made stuff closer together, like the workbenches. Uh, labs, you know, easy stuff. So we nip in here. Our flamey pain. We got a core. It's a flamethrower. I don't know how to do it. It's just an alternate fire mode. Flames the enemy with a burning mixture. That did. I don't know how to do that. And I don't plan on looking at it. I'll figure it out by mistake. Um, unfortunately, we still have the mimicry with the double burst. But I don't want to lose the mines. The mines have proven to be quite powerful. And did I do, I think, oh yes, we did this. And I've got what I need to do, the boiler upgrade. That's why I haven't gone any further. <laughs> Boom. What we got? Armory 2. Unlocks upgrade, extraction the weapon core. I mean, I can extract that core anyway. Uh, but we, <laughs> yeah, we, we don't have the materials we need for this, because... I've, I've been burning all sorts of stuff I shouldn't be burning to get this done. Um, oh wait, yeah, I increased our storage as well. And we had a little tidy. This is all pretty much empty. Because we, we've used everything. I've got some, some scrap in there, okay. I'm sure there was some wood in one of these, this one. Yeah, yeah you can take that. The idea is the top will be metal, the bottom will be wood, and then this will be all of these type of supplies. We've got a few spaces, all but I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to put in them all. We'll burn that bridge when we get to it. In the meantime, what? I did that when I started as well. <laughs> we got the full steam engine. I'm not sure it means anything. Let's have a look here. Yeah, it doesn't, doesn't seem to make a difference. What well, I could do is have a quick look at the board and see what it actually does. Because I think it just said um, increases steam capacity. I don't know if that increases speed or. But since I don't worry about speed, I just sit and I chill and I move through the world. I also need to work out how to put these lights nicely. But again, that's something we'll deal with later. What prophecies do we have and what benefit are they? Speed swimming in the void. So we'll see what that gives us. I don't want a shark attack. I don't want to. I don't, I don't want to train. But let's just see what happens when we put them in. So I'm pretty sure I can take. Oh no, I don't need to put it in. in. So extra shark attacks, but it gives me more wood. Could be good. We get the chance. Of an encounter. More organics, more dirty ice. So don't ring those. Just more items in general. So we move slower. There are just more items. I'm going to do that. That seems like it could be useful. And not too risky at this stage. Um, yeah, we're good. You good? Nice. Let's... Uh, Let's go. Oh yeah, I better check this. Check this before I get... Make sure I haven't left anything useful. My leather full. I think it was. It was. And I, I... Yeah, we're just going to get so much. Uh, that one. <laughs> Onwards. Can we get a pretty area this time? This is so much nicer with the graphics upgrade. Yep. Loving it. 
Uh, boring RNG. Lock it down, lock it down. Right, time for me to spend four hours gathering stuff that I don't particularly need. I wonder where the shark is. I need the shark because Ken's has called me out on my tracking. Which I'm going to admit isn't overly the best in the world, but it's not as bad as he keeps telling me. Oh! I'm pretty sure the shark's around. Alright. Oh, we hit. Not great hits, but we hit. Uh, since I'm not so fussed with ammo anymore, since I know how bloody abundant it is, where's the bastard? I like how he's swimming in the fog. I mean, he had a pretty epic introduction. Damn it. I see you, fat bitch. Come get me. Ah, uh, fog's clearing. We hit him with all of them that time. I suppose the biggest problem, especially when uh, it's a game you've not played, is understanding how the tracking works. Sometimes it just looks like you're bad at shooting and you'll miss. Which happens to me a lot. I think he's stuck in the fucking train. <laughs> Um, but yeah, other times you can be just missing. Just be incredibly unlucky with placing the shots. Like, don't get me wrong, I'm by no means the best. I have my moments. But in general, I'm not that good at shooting, I never have been. But you do kind of get used to the way uh, AI is going to behave. We had this uh, deep conversation about how shit I am at games. Like that. See, my biggest problem is, like you just saw then, I get impatient and I rush. It happens with everything. If you see me play chess or play me at chess, the best thing you can do is just to slow everything down. I'll get bored and I'll make a stupid mistake. Hitting these things is just a pain in the ass. It's going to take me two days to get one of these. It's going to take me three weeks if I just shoot. That whole train car. I mean, this area is pretty. I think that, you know, that might actually genuinely be a whole train car. Damn. Well, we haven't gone far. Not going to lie about it. I've been slowly collecting these guys. Hate this thing, but yeah, we're not. We're just stopping, starting, grabbing all the materials. It's not overly fast. But we have picked up a few things. So that I need. How many grease did we use? I think we used two. Uh, sure, we used four. Oh, nice. Let's just get that out of the way. Pretty sure he just chucked up some more materials for us. Let's grease. So let's get that refilled. Oops. Wait, wait. Take that. I don't plan on using it since I'm picking them up. You might as well just burn it off there. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's that. We've got some excess water. I'm just going to start eating the smaller bits. So, zinc? Zinc, nice. We've got a decent amount of zinc. Uh, excess leather. Do I keep in scrap? I was like, oh, they're showing me what I need to repair it. Use. Use. And then food. I've got another case for stakes now since that's going to be important for fertilizer let's go check out this 
big ass wrecked train. I haven't left much behind. There's a few bits and pieces. Um, notably a big water because we're just picking up so many little waters. I genuinely can't be asked to be taking the big one as well. Yeah, we'll have that. Uh, and that. There you are. Hey, this is the this is the same layout as the back car of mine. Oh, chunk, nice, nice. Coal chunk, nice. Am I, if I get in the coal chunk out of each of these, no. but even if it's just one off of every car. Oh, there's another coal chunk. Okay, so we've got a decent amount of fuel. It does actually give a decent amount of light. So that's nice that you can get these in multiples. Because every time I've come across it, it's pretty much just been one, maybe two, but one of them's not been a proper lootable one. And then we had three gigantic lootable ones. I just stick them on my train. <laughs> That'd be nice. Yoink. You don't tease me. Tracking though. Right. Um. Yeah, I gotta get you because of your friends are gone. Uh, we can't take the fat. Ah. <sighs> Back to the grind. I mean, we picked up a fair amount of resource saving stuff. One thing we can do once we do something else is so get rid of those. And those. Me? Okay. Uh, come down here. Ding, 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 ding. You need fuel, do you? Ah. No, actually. Oh, I didn't have the. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Why would I use my wood when there's a nice piece of fat just sat out here doing nothing? You're coming with me and you're going in there. I also realised, despite the fact I'm in a hurry, I did put it like so that there's more items to get. And I move slower. Which might not have been my smartest idea. Right, now we can take this water. I should have saved a chemical for that. I did not know that. I mean, I clearly, probably at some stage, did know that. I just did not remember that. Uh, oh, well, that's interesting because we've actually got enough of that on me and I just didn't bother to look. Yeah, he did. Components, instead of chemicals, make me two of those. Then when that's done, she's just going to drop that to get it out of the way. Oh. Out of your. Do that. I'm just going to come off the back end of the trainer. Roll the lever up. Bye. Thank you. Now you're done. I'm going to go in here and take you. Make that bad boy. We need to get as many of those as possible because I want to start. I don't really want to be using no wood, but I want to start getting. Like a stockpile of steel bars and brass. As that seems to be the main problem. But does mean we will not be using coal to uh, boost the train anymore. As that is a very limited resource and I don't want to be using it all. Going fast. Yeah, and there you go. Do someone first. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Get you in there. And then here. Yeah, we're flying with materials. Right. That's that done. And now we're back to the boring bits. Come here. I said, come here. I said, come here. You're making me look bad in front of my friends. Uh, oh, yeah. Like that. See, I can do it. I see a little sneaky bitch. Thank you. Ooh. We're having a good cold day. I'm also picking up an obnoxious amount of water. Which is kind of annoying. 
You can also see I didn't spend that much time doing this. Because these guys haven't generated much stuff. Now, do I have what I need to make? Give me clear. I have to make one. Yeah, I'm nearly enough. Time for two. We can take... Two... Two... Actually, just gonna use them. Like, there's a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. And I'm gonna have to spend some time getting some more... The big woods up. Everyone knows I enjoy a big wood. But in the meantime, at least we've got some coal going. And we're starting to replenish our supplies quite nicely. Hey, looks like we found ourselves an arena island. It'll be fun, we get to experiment with the new bad guy type. And hopefully we can get ourselves some good loot. I mean, this is all new to me. I totally haven't made sure I've repaired my gun and that I filled up on armor and, and all the stuff I'm probably going to need when I'm in there. Okay, I did a little bit. Now, I'm thinking once I land, that'll stop the train. The thing is like a safety measure. Once you land, the train stops. It's not going to naturally stop here, but... We wait until it gets to this point here. And then I touch down. Oh yeah, I forgot this one doesn't actually touch down. Uh. Yeah, I think it's safe to stop the train from buggering off once you're on an island that you can stay on. Uh, kind of safety points. I forgot I don't get to actually touch the floor here. Right, uh... Let's go. This can't be bad. Our first, maybe second experience with uh, the new arena islands. You watch as we get the, uh, the one we always got. <laughs> Which, funny enough, wasn't the one when we uh, checked it. Yeah, four materials. Metal, wood, and chemicals. See, I always thought that looked funny, but I don't know if I explained it last time. Well, give us a, give us a new map. It's a nice new map. Yep. Okay. So we got the. I think we had the forest one we spawned into last time. The annoying thing is I don't know where I'm gonna hide and fight from. I don't know the spawn plans. Ah. They kind of come from that way. That one got all up in my face. Okay, not too bad. Um, don't really want to be sparing ammo, so we got 250 in the boxes. Bite on. Oops. Let's do that, because that makes a, a sense. Bad for two reasons, because it lowers the quality of the gun. Woo, they're all up my butt. Kind of blurring in. Okay, that was easy enough. Concerned at the amount of damage I've taken so far. Doesn't bode well for us in the long run. Let's change to you. Keep them coming. I need these resources. I don't think coming this way is the smartest idea because of the bushes. Also, I kind of want to see the rest of the map. Speaking of which, he fell through it. Yeah, something behind me. My ass is on fire. I think you were one of the new exploding ones. 
possibly just one I put on fire. It's more jungly, isn't it? It's nice and not nice. <laughs> There's a new layout because I, I don't know. Hey, what's this? Are you dropping ammunition? That's a bit fucking cheeky. Let's go this way. Whoa! Not my best decision ever. Where did you come from? Okay. I think the uh, like when ah uh, crap. I think when we played last time, I whined about the fact that they're not aggressive enough and don't hunt you down. Uh, it yeah, it would appear that somebody bigger than me made the same complaint and they listened to them. <laughs> we can already hold two less bullets. That's unfortunate. That first box. So what it kind of seems is like they kind of spawn and then they'll just start digging through. Whoa! I think we just experienced a uh, exploder first hand. So fighting in the open like that is not a good idea. I feel quite low on ammo. And yeah, ammo does spawn. So it's now becoming even more important to have multiple gun types. Which isn't too much of a problem. If I have a second gun, we can bring it on the arena excursions and leave it in a box on the train when we're exploring and... Oh! So the explosions look like that. Just good to know and easy to avoid if I can keep eyes on him. Jam. I think there's something behind me. There is. Yeah, funny. Does it actually tell me the condition of the gun? Six. I did not mean to use that, but sold it. So it, it appear every now and again it drops ammo. We're doing all right. We're on seven. Wait a second. Yeah, we can use some ammo. Problem is, I'm literally using it for just one. We'll have a quick snack. Um. Yeah, we are. We are here. I think. Okay. Ooh. We need to get down into a corridor. Safety corridor. Especially while the exploder is still about. Nice. Well, it's, it's nice if we assume there's only one. Which there is not. Run like a little bitch. Fucking jam. getting fruity. I like the changes. New maps, good. More aggressive bad guys, good. More damage, more hunting me down, less me hunting them down. Good. Do it more rewards. Bigger pockets, maybe. No exploders, good. Definitely got caught by one. Nearly got caught by a second. Oh, 
Uh, pretty sure two exploders. Pretty sure they both exploded. My gun jammed. I don't know if that was invisible. <laughs> Not ideal, because I couldn't fire. <laughs> Fuck, I didn't realise you were there. Go for the map. Nice. So the ammo count is working in our favour for here. Because we don't need to make as much ammo as we used to. Which is nice. Oh, only nine, but I do need to keep going because I'm pretty sure I need a lot more of these um, stomach stomaches. No, I'm sure they're useful for sound, I just can't remember what it was. Uh. Oh, there's two, two more. Oh, that's not cool. They should affect the group. Ah, uh, see, I got bored and I panicked and I missed every single shot. Take time. Take shots. Jam the gun. Son of a bitch, that's my armor. Tickled me, tickled me bits a bit. It couldn't tickle you. Hmm. I don't know where I was going with that. This is kind of cool though. There's, there's wooden stairs because these bugs have the ability to build wooden stairs. That's kind of scary. What? Just dropping the shit I don't want. Yeah, next chest. Next chest, next chest. Let's go. I'm really concerned if I'm going to start getting three exploders. I'm pretty sure I just jammed. Keep running. There goes an air. Oh, we need to go. Uh, can I do that on the run? I didn't do as much as I thought it would. You need to do one, mate. Panic, not picking my shots. Oh, that one got bloody close. Uh, I don't like how many armor I don't have left. And how many health I don't have left. How many bullets I don't have left. <laughs> and we're only two thirds through. Okay, there's ammo at the spawn point. None of it's any good for me. Okay, one of it was good for me and that gave me 30, did it? 50. Uh, well, we may as well use up the rest of our ammo. We may as well use up the rest of our food and water. I'm going to take a quick second, check some stuff, <laughs> let my health regenerate a bit. So, I think the biggest issue here is, especially now, with those exploders, you can get extremely unlucky, lose everything, just on a gun jam. Whereas before, there was, there was a little bit of play. Uh, a little bit of luck. They had to get a lot more a lot more skillful with their blanking. Now you just need one of those to spawn at the wrong place and explode. The amount of damage you take. Uh, like that, that little bastard coming out in the middle. Oh, nearly got me. You nearly got me. Oh, you serious? Oh, crap. That's not a fucking gun. I can die. Uh, you're to my left, and I've only got one hand on the keyboard. 
we've got to actually improve the damage of this thing. Kind of makes it more useful than it used to be. Not as useful as this. Didn't really fancy unjamming it. Oh, I always remembered it as more. It was like less. But again, I'm pretty sure we need the acid stomachs. Uh, we're going to need the chests. We're getting to the point where literally the only things left that are really unlockable soon are going to be the um, stuff you get from the mushrooms. The problem there, which you just saw, and I got incredibly fucking lucky with that, is when you focus down, you can get proper flanked by those bloody exploders. Now, it doesn't seem the rest of the guys do much damage when they flank on me. Fucking serious. I don't know what the hell killed you, but I'll take it. But yeah, you get you get caught with your pants down with one of those exploders. I mean, I'll, I'll go back in the edit and I'll see how much damage I actually took from that one going off on me, but I don't like it took off. Like, 60, 70 health. The ammo is not to the point where it's angry. So that's, that's well, angry game changing. 67. We still got three more waves. Oh. Still not sure this is the right path to take. It feels like it may be good. Bollock! Okay, we got out of the way. Okay, close enough to trigger them. No, we got hit. That's not fair. Panicking. Panicking. Oh, oh, fuck. No ammo. It's not good. That's not the right gun. Your bloody armor's good. We're going to have to slow play the last few. Problems are running out of healing stuff as well. Whoa! Asshole! Tell me again, I can't track. Uh, two more bloody waves. I mean, we could use the rifle to clear the first start. At least. Let's see, 13, 14. Six. I think on wave 15, they should give you two of the stomachs. Guess it's kind of bothered me that you get. Two full stacks and then one short of a full stack. And it really is, for the first time in ages, an actual risk to move on to the next stage of the challenge. Again, I want those loots. Those loots are important to me. Oh, I should have armoured and healed. Run! Definitely run! Can heal. Run. Okay, that's the clip gone. Yeah, get fucked. Ah, I didn't mean it. Don't hurt me. Ah, uh, yeah. yeah. So fucking many of them. Run. My ass. Stop blowing holes in my ass. I need a bigger gun. Uh. You tried to catch me off of the past. Okay, they all got one healing pack and one armor. 
Stop shooting me through the floor. Well, I can't complain, because they seem to have addressed almost every single whinge I had about the bloody arena. <laughs> the only benefit we have now is we're going to have more oh nice we're going to have more bullets with the main gun going in the last round <laughs> oh. oh no I suppose another benefit is we've now got an empty inventory to take everything, well, as much of everything as we can. <laughs> oh, I, I better get decent chest chests. If I get ones and twos again, I'm going to be gutted. Like, literally gutted. Like, there should maybe be a restriction. So, like, the first box you get can be one, two, or three. The second box you get can be two, three, or four. And the final box can be three, four, or five. But again, that would still explain the one, two, three I got last time. So I shut my mouth. Oh no! Do I take the risk? Wait, can I actually save? Can. Is it really a risk if I can save? <laughs> Guaranteed it doesn't carry on. Right. Uh, so that way. Right, fingers crossed, boys. Zip once more onto the breach. I didn't check if that was one or two. It's probably only one. Can't focus for long. Is that going to happen? Bollocks. There goes all my armor. Run. Fucking die. Fucking drink. Run. Stop missing. Oh, fucking boss. Oh, look at all that loot. I'm not going to be able to loot because the, the ammo's in the way you watch. Okay. <laughs> Don't fucking do it to me. We've, we've already done <laughs> bloody hell. Oh. Well, we'll come back for the rest. Okay, so two, two twos and... and Pretty sure that's a four. Hmm. Oh, shit myself. Just checking, I can still only carry one, right? Yeah. Uh-oh. I was going to say, don't fuck me around with that. Don't give me a good treasure chest and then lock it behind the fucking ammo. So I've effectively learned Ammo and health are more important in the arena. The arena's genuinely, generally, a little bit harder. Um, the loot seems to be roughly the same. Let's put that away. Uh, like that. Make me some more. Just because it takes up less space. We've got a decent amount of stuff. Uh, boom, boom. Yeah, I'm gonna need more bloody stuff. More chess. <laughs> also, I need to labels on the boxes. That's what we need. Nice. And yeah, I'm pretty sure this is a two, and that's a four. So, like the pure just wooden ones are one, and the wooden ones with the silver trim are probably two. Then like brass trim is three, or maybe they're three. And the brass trims too and that's four and then there's that big shiny golden one which we've had in the past which is uh the bigger one 
we'll take that. Let's have a quick, quick goosey gander at the supplies we've actually got on us. Okay, so we can up the ammo if we need to. We'll leave it for now. Get me one of you. So we need to rebuild all of our med packs, all of our armor. Actually, it's not too bad with the armor, is it? It's just literally that. The problem is the med packs, I think, use leather, and I've kind of gone off of using leather. Yeah. Don't really want to be using leather. It needed a sterilizer. What does the sterilizer need? Chemicals or something, I imagine. No, food. No, yes. Food. Oh, damn it. Okay, so it kind of got more expensive. I need to get a second gun, so that needs to be our focus. Get a hunter or a shotgun. Oh, that's that's our job at the next station. I mean, the fun. If you enjoyed this episode, then tickle the like button, perhaps subscribe, and check out the rest of the channel. And why not join us on the Facebook, Twitter, it's called Patreon. You know all of the stuff. I've been Landis. This has been Void Train. Thank you very much. See you soon.